humans of the universe! Welcome back to another video. It's your girl Pepper, and today we are celebrating the release of the Magic Capsule. If you're not familiar with me, hi, what's up? I'm Pepper, I'm the Bronx Makeup Fairy. I have just released my first official merch. I am wearing my Stay Magical beanie. This is my fairy beanie, and that says Stay Magical. As you guys know, if you are familiar with my YouTube channel, at the end of every video, I tell you guys, Stay Magical. So I felt like this was what I had to put as one of my first merch releases. Staying magical to me just means that you are always embracing your inner magic, whether that's your artistry, whether that's optimistic personality. You are spreading magic, you're not spreading hate. And so when you wear this, you automatically gain magical powers to spread, okay? I have her here and she also comes in two other colors. We have this beautiful fiery orange. And then, you know, I had to do it in hot pink as well, you guys. So look at us, we're cute. She's comfortable, she's cozy, and she is embroidered to perfection. So these are made to last you a long time. Come in, okay? If you don't know, I'm from New York, I'm from the Bronx, and we get winter. I mean, even though this year it hasn't really been winter winter, you know, it still gets kind of cold and whatnot. So she's gonna keep you nice and warm all winter long. Or if you're in like California, you know, they rock beanies, I think, throughout the whole year. So the skater boys, <laughs> right? And then we also have have the fairy dust sticker this is me everyone yes this is me modeling one of my iconic fairy makeup transformations that you can find on my instagram page it's just a holographic magical being honestly speaking you could slap her on your laptop you could slap her on your little mini beauty fridge you could slap her on a stop sign tag me on instagram when you get yours i want to see where you decide to slap your fairy dust sticker and then we have the official fairy family pin she has my official logo on her perfected by pepper makeup artist and she loves to travel so please put her on your backpack put her on your denim jacket on your leather jacket she is a beautiful rectangular shape this is just a great way if you are a supporter of what i do as a makeup artist and who i am this is a great way to show me off to the universe and other fellow fairies who might be interested in booking your girl you could be like yeah pepper that's my makeup artist you know what i'm saying or yeah pepper that's my best friend or yeah pepper you know i had pizza with her one time She's pretty cool. She does makeup. This is a great way to spread the word. And last but certainly not least, ladies and gentlemen, we have the Magic Tees. I am wearing one right now. I am going to be showing you guys in the next clip of me modeling it off. I am wearing the Magic Tee in Moon Fairy. And I also have the Magic Tea in Snow Fairy, which is in all white. And it brings me such great joy to have this capsule for you guys. Doing merch is something that I've always wanted to do. However, I didn't know like if it would be possible. With COVID, we already faced so many challenges and I figured that doing something like this during this time wouldn't really catch anyone's attention. You know, a lot of people are penny pinching right now and the last thing I wanted to do is make it seem like it is about money. These I were made with 100% love. They were made by myself and Bronx artists as well. And this is, again, my first ever merch and a way for me to put my stamp on the world in a sense. <laughs> All of the proceeds of the Magic Capsule will be going towards my 2021 goal of me accomplishing beauty school. I am not a licensed cosmetologist or esthetician. However, makeup is my passion and I have been loving it for seven years now and I have done everything that I possibly can to better myself as a self-taught artist. I just think that it is time for me to really go into school and learn more new things, create better opportunities, more relationships, and so on and so forth. I'm so grateful to have you guys on this journey with me. Now, I'm so sorry I didn't mention before, but my hats are for $25, my magic tees are $30, my fairy family buttons are 10 bucks, and my stickers are $5. Now, I am going to pull up my website for you all on my screen here, and you guys are going to join me in the journey of the Magic Capsule release page. First things first, as you guys can see, I have the most amazing photographs of my mom 
models that I will get to at the end telling you guys exactly who they are. These photos were taken in my local bodega, a bodega that I grew up going to as a kid and I was just so happy that they were so supportive of my vision and they basically gave me free range to take photos <laughs> as much as I wanted in this store and so I'm so grateful and so happy I was able to accomplish that in this specific place. These photos are incredible. They represent myself, my brand, and my friends that are in them. Like I told them be themselves, you know, don't be afraid to, to really take it there and I really love all of these photos so genuinely and they're incredible. They were taken by uh, my friend Alejandro Tavares. I will have on my website as well where you can book his services. I did the makeup of course on everyone in this photo shoot and I shared the hair responsibilities with my homegirl Bridget and Natalie. Now here we have the magic merch! So as you can see I have photos of each of the products and how they look on models, how they wear the colors and just how they look in their full effect. And scrolling down a little bit we can see the actual story behind this capsule. So I'm just gonna read it to you guys aloud so you guys can really see the vision. Being a Bronx native I wanted to give you the feeling that I got as a kid when I walked to bodega getting my fairy candies sandwiches or snacks that's the energy that i was going for for this concept as a proud new yorker i combine the feeling you got during that experience with the magic of makeup the magic capsule is my first ever merchandise launch and everything is limited quantity i only made a specific small amount of each item so guys get them while you can i really wanted to make this super exclusive for my favorite family now if you scroll down just a little bit more we're gonna get into meet the gang this is where i break down who each of these models were because they were specifically chosen for this concept shoot. Everyone here is an artist themselves. Hensley. Y'all may know this beauty as Hensley, but to me, this is day. My best bitch since 2016. She's a fashion blogger, lover of all things sparkly, and one of my muses from the moment I asked her about her shoe size, which is a big insider with us because we used to work in a thrift or buy sell trade called Crossroads Training, and I was working there prior to her, and what we used to do whenever someone new started there was to ask them what their shoe size was. This way, when we are bringing in merchandise into the store, we can make sure to look out for them. You know, if we find a cute pair of shoes in their size, let them know. When I met Day, I think that I approached her so bubbly and I was just like, hey, I'm Ashley, what's your name? And then I was just like, what's your shoe size? And she was just so like, I'm an eight. <laughs> So that was the first moment that we really interacted and I fell in love with her as my friend. She was already chosen, she didn't know. She was one of the first people I met in my adulthood that accepted me for my bubbly, wild, free-spirited personality. She's not afraid to speak her own mind as well to me or to anyone and she still loves me after I'm always getting her into some trouble. She knows what I'm talking about, guys. <laughs> you can keep up with her fashion and hella cute husky Evie on Instagram and I attached a link, of course, so that way you guys can click on her page. And now scrolling down, we have Shane. Shane is the creator of Brooklyn clothing brand Norm NYC. We became friends through Instagram around 2017 and admired each other's work. He had booked me for one of his first shoots of his brand to do some very fun glittery tears on a model from a look that I had done on myself prior. And his quirky personality and style always makes me feel so comfortable. He's always made me feel like family around him. And he's one of the few people I would travel to Brooklyn for. If y'all live in the Bronx, then y'all know that's a big deal okay and we have real friendship there please check out his website so you can spend some coin on some norm nyc merch and you can also follow him on instagram scrolling down we have amber so if you guys don't know amber is the one behind the lens she is who edits and films all of my youtube magical content for you guys here amber num nums is my right hand gal i met her in high school and funny enough it wasn't until after we graduated that our relationship really became what it is now we worked together for my youtube channel my igtv series peppers made up closet but guys Amber has magic of her own and she's been filming and editing for YouTube since the 6th grade. 6th grade everyone! Okay? She is a huge Aranator aka Ariana Grande fan and a cat lover. I'm so happy to have her a part of my journey not just as my team member but as my self sister. Okay? She's with me when the camera's are on, when the camera's are off throughout all of these years and it's been so 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 crazy because like a lot of the things that you guys are seeing for yourselves these are things that we just had in conversation at one point and we used to always 
brainstorm our ideas but then we weren't able to turn these things into actual reality and I'm so happy to have such a strong year with her where we literally did everything we said we would do if things didn't flow according to plan we didn't give up the idea we just kind of figured out how to work around it so so happy and so grateful to have Ambizzle on my team and on my friendship squad okay Amiga's cheat is for life you can definitely book Amber for your filming editing needs I linked her Instagram there and subscribe to her own YouTube channel so you could join her num nums family pretty cool I'm not gonna lie cuz like I'm a part of it too you know what I'm saying so if you want to join us like we here <laughs> And you can also follow her on Instagram. Scrolling down. Now we're going to get into Kadeem. Kadeem is another Brooklyn artist that I had the pleasure to meet this year. His soulmate, Natasha, and I are really good friends. She put me onto his art. He's a painter. He has his own IGTV series, Dean Doodles, where he sketches out drawings based on suggestions from his viewers and even has his own merch for his brand, Life of Dean. I was grateful for his participation for his shoot. He came all the way from Brooklyn. So big shout out to you, Kadeem. Thank you so much for joining in on this day. He really penciled me in and i'm just so 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 happy and i love how his shots came out with these big flinging rings maybe you guys will see a pepper deem collab in the future let me know guys if you would be interested i'm definitely down and you could check out his instagram and shop his website as well scrolling on down we have mav burr, 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 burr. savvy mavi the bronx favorite rock star i met mav in 2018 through mutual friends and we partied a lot together <laughs> a lot Okay, we've seen some shit together. Her spirit is always raw and true to her emotions, and I've always admired that. Mav booked me for my first ever studio photo shoot a few years back, and we worked together for Norm NYC campaigns too. Besides the working aspect though, I've shared some wickedly fun memories with Mav and hope that this shall continue. Her don't give a fuck attitude is why we all love her. She's a poet, she's a rapper, she's a model, and I'm sure she's low-key a magician, okay? You could keep up with her on Instagram here. Don't be shy and enjoy her memes. <laughs> And last but not least, we have Louis Santana. Louis and I went to high school together. Um, again, our friendship really flourished more after we graduated. His sense of humor is one of a kind, and since he is now a model, best believe you guys are gonna see him in my portfolio way more because he is not afraid to take it there. He is not afraid to wear makeup, and we love that, okay? Not only is he a model, though, he is also a dancer and actor, so the universe, you guys better watch out, okay? And you can tap into his Instagram page link below. Of course, I had to do a special thanks. I I felt like this would have been not possible doing this magic capsule without the people who I think below here. Special thanks to the Palo Blanco Grocery. This is the bodega that we shot the photo shoot at and this is my childhood bodega. So please, if you're in the Bronx area, I linked the address for this bodega. Please go get a sandwich, bacon and cheese, go get your beer, lottery tickets, all that good stuff. Support this business. They have been thriving on my block for years now and I'm just so happy that COVID did not take them out. So thank you guys so much. And they were so supportive on everything. They did not give us an issue at all during our shooting time. And we were there for a couple of hours. Huge thank you to you guys. Then we have my supportive boyfriend, John Paul. JP, thank you so much for always supporting me. Always making me feel like the sky is the limit. You have never made me feel as if what I'm doing is the absolute most or I need to simmer it down. You always accept me for who I am in and out. And I love you so much and I thank you for always pushing me to be a better me. You know I'm crying on the inside. <laughs> then we have a special thank you to Alejandro A.T. the Great. This is who created this amazing photography and videography for this campaign shoot. Alejandro is a friend of mine. I've known a couple years now and I really appreciate you for working on this project with me. With the experience that you had, I knew that this was just going to blossom and these photos are some of my favorites. I can't wait to print them out, frame them and hang them in my studio. Like truly, these are iconic and I thank you so much for being a part of this of course i had to thank my mom dad nana and yaya of course my grandma letty as well my family is the reason i go so damn hard okay like the magic that i'm able to share with you guys here it all comes from them essentially it's just how i was raised my dad has always installed so many different kind of values in my mind and my grandparents since i was really young and i think that that is what keeps me so level-headed and wanting to push myself for more because there's so much more that like things that we haven't even tapped into our own selves yet that I know that I would love to share with you guys along the way so I love you guys so much and I thank you guys for supporting me on my little journey because you guys really saw it from the ground up you guys saw it when it was just an idea you guys saw it from it being nothing to what it is now and 
to what it's gonna be in the future. So thank you guys, and I love you guys. Five ever. <laughs> and last, but certainly not least, you on the other side of this screen my fairy family thank you guys so much listen i didn't even have a fairy family i don't even think prior to like 2020 <laughs> you know what i mean like i did but i didn't know i did if that makes sense i really 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 found myself uh, a fairy family like you guys and it's so incredible and i thank you guys so much for supporting me if you've never met me and you support me if you've seen me a hundred times you support me if you want to meet me and support me listen i appreciate you guys so much like you have no idea i try to prove to guys that i am actually a human being you know i'm a real life human being and you're not just supporting some robot <laughs> that doesn't really exist on planet earth i'm here what's up thank you for your support i love you guys and i hope that you enjoy the capsule like i said it's very limited so grab an item while you can and thank you so much when you guys get your items in the mail please 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 with the cherry on top record the opening the unboxing i want to see your reactions i'm huge on reactions i love surprise my friends and stuff so please please record the moment if you can and send it to me through dm or whatever the case may be i want to see it and i want to see what you guys think about everything so i think that's about it you guys i hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up comment down below on which item you see yourself wearing and i love you guys so much have a fairy friday and stay magical